In this video, I will fully review two on-budget RGB strip lights of the brand Gida LED that is designed to add color and great atmosphere to your media room, your working space and save your cash. And I will cover their pros, their cons and everything you need to know to make the best purchasing decision. So without further ado, let's start! And before we start, I want to share with you a disclaimer. This RGB strip lights was sent to us by the brand Gida LED to test out the products and share our honest opinions. And if you're interested, you will find all the links in the description of the video. And now let's start with the first strip light. In the box, you are getting installation kit and instructions. And two units of RGB strip lights. The length of each RGB strip light is 6.5 feet, which is overall 13 feet. They're connected directly to the Zigbee wireless controller. It's really nice because you can add or disconnect one of the strip lights at any time accordingly to your needs. The strip light covers most of my 65 inches Samsung TV. This strip light should fit to screens up to 75 inches, but you'll end up with areas without lighting. And I must mention, this strip light is the easiest one to work with because it's so thin and flexible, so even if you don't have connectors for the corners, you can bend the strip and make loops effortlessly without losing much of the length. Moreover, it's RGBW strip light, so you will see across the strip light two chips. The first chip is SMD5050 that provides only RGB colors. And the second chip is SMD3020, which provides only warm white light. To activate the strip light, we need to connect it to the USB port of the TV. In case you don't have a USB port on your device, then you can use the charger of your phone. The second RGB strip light is 9.8 feet long. It connects to Zigbee wireless controller with USB connector, and it should fit screens up to 65 inches, but it doesn't cover the entire frame of my 65-inch TV. The installation of this triplet was very challenging because it is much thicker and durable and less flexible compared to the first strip light, and the build quality feels very good. Compared to the previous strip light, this one is RGBWW, so you will see across the strip light three chips. The first chip is SMD5050, which provides only RGB colors. The second chip is SMD3020, that provides only cold white light. And the third chip is SMD3020 as well, and it's providing only warm white light. Both of the RGB strip lights have Zigbee 3.0 wireless controller. To connect the controller to the network, it requires gateway hubs, like Tuya Smart Hub or Lightify Gateway. But if you have Echo Show 2nd generation, Echo Plus 2nd generation, or Echo Studio, then you don't need a hub. To operate the strip light, you will need the Smart Life app. It's user-friendly and stable app. Zigbee provides a huge advantage to their strip lights compared to the ones who work with Wi-Fi. Because the Zigbee network is very stable, the discovery process and the setup of the strip lights are so easy and it takes only a few minutes. Firstly, let's focus on the RGBW strip light. Now we can link the strip light to the smart assistants like Amazon Alexa or Google Assistant. In my case, it will be Amazon Alexa. And the integration between the Smart Life and Amazon Alexa apps works so well every time and the discovery process of the devices is immediate. On the Amazon app, you can choose the colors for the strip light from the following list, or change the RGB lighting to warm white mode. And if you're a more advanced user, then you can set automation for the strip light. But whether you're using Smart Assistant or not, the Smart Life app provides much more control over the strip light. You have wider levels of brightness, you can adjust for the warm lighting. On the color tab, you have wider range of colors to choose from and adjust their vibrance and brightness. And lastly, we have music mode, which is fantastic. Gida LED excels in developing strip lights that syncs accurately with the beat of the music. The colors of the strip light are beautiful and vibrant, and the lighting itself is gentle and pleasant, which makes it suitable for decorative purposes. And I recommend keeping the strip light close to the wall to achieve the best results. 
The warm white lighting has the yellowish shade and the temperature is 3000 Kelvin. This kind of color temperature gives cozy and sleepy feeling. It also seems much stronger than the RGB lights and lights up the space much better, but you can dim the warm light to provide a relaxed and romantic mood for the space. Let's move on to the second strip light. The lighting is gorgeous. The colors are vibrant and bright, and the colors I chose from the Smart Life app had accurate output. When the music mode is activated, the light syncs beautifully with the beat of the music, which upgrades the entire experience in the media room when you watch movies or play games. Here's what I see. I see a festival that never ends. The warm white light is very surprising. It has a combination of orange and yellow colors, which reminds me the lava of the volcano. This lighting is very strong and lights up the space so well. It's so strong because in this mode, the warm white chip and the cool white chip are activated at the same time and that provides the strong light. But you can soft the warm light by dimming it. Also, you can set cool white at a temperature of 6500 Kelvin. It's providing much natural lighting. And compared to the warm white, this cool white looks much softer and gentle even at its highest level of brightness. Like any other product in the market, this RGB strip lights has few cons that you have to take into consideration. And the first one is, both of them are not water resistant, so you can use them only indoors. And the controller of the RGB WW strip light has a hole which exposes the entire electronics and the wiring, so you really have to keep it away from steamy and moisture areas. Yes. Thirdly, it's very recommended to use connectors kit for the installation of the strip lights because it's making the installation process so much easier and it's preserving the strip lights. But unfortunately, it's very difficult to find a decent kit of 5 pins or 6 pins connectors. To see more reviews of RGB strip lights, check out the next playlist.